Hold it. The signal. That's... No, we're too far away. There's too much interference from the anomaly and coordinates. But, I have a direction. What is it? It's either in the forest or somewhere beyond. What aren't you telling me? Nobody's ever come back alive from the forest. Yeah, I figured you were going to say something like that. Listen. You hear that? Something's under the signal. Is that... Is that what it is? Whatever it is, let's not keep it waiting. Jakob, prepare the truck. We're heading towards the forest. Oh, the forest? Of course. Driving into savage, uncharted territory and breathing a fungus that liquefies your organs was on my list of things to do today. You know, if I had a fucking nickel for every time... Maybe we switch the radio off for a little while. <laughs> Right? Can we go already?
Nope, you're just gonna make it worse. No, I got it, I got it. So, we've got problems. Insurgents have taken the quarry and the only road headed east has been mine. There's no way through unless we talk to Corrigan. He's the Grand Marshal up in Trenchtown, and he is an unknown for being generous to strangers. Fortunately, I told that charming young lady out there that we were headed east, and now... Don't she... tell people where we're going. Right, I wouldn't normally, but it turns out she's Corrigan's associate. She'll give us an intro if we help her drive up a package. Whoa, what kind of package? <laughs> <laughs> Try anything, Gnarly? And your short, pathetic life is over. Oh, it ain't over till it's over, sweetheart. <laughs> you? Who are you? Chana. <laughs> I go to the end of the fucking world and you're still in my fucking face? <sighs> go drown in your bottle, asshole. <sighs> Why am I not surprised to see you in chains again? <laughs> That girl, is she a friend of yours? Someone from a long time ago. Any reason she hates your gut so much? Many. <laughs> 